Hello everyone, right here, and you're probably wondering why it took me so long to get this video up. Well, I am now working two jobs, a full-time job and a part-time job. So I now have less and less free time. But because of that, any day I get that's that I have free time, I'm going to try to do a video for you so that I can get videos out more often than not now that I have less and less free time. Anywho, we're going to go over my July monthly haul. Very small haul. I only got four things in the month of July. And we're going to start with the only DVD I picked up, and it's Fun with Dick and Jane. Got this from Macari, and it's pretty neat. It's in a blockbuster case. So, yeah, I've, I've seen this movie a few times. It, it's fun for what it is. I find the ending to be quite boring in this movie, actually. I don't very much like the ending of this movie. But the first, like, 30, 40 minutes of this movie are pretty fun. Now, I have never seen the original one, which I really want to see. I gotta see about getting that for the collection. But yeah, Fun with Dick and Jane. And it doesn't have a Blu-ray. That's why I have it on DVD. The next one I picked up is Good Burger, the Steelbook edition. Um... I didn't grow up with this movie, so I don't really have a very big attachment to this movie as a lot of people do, but I recently watched it with my niece, and my niece absolutely loved this movie, and I had a blast watching it with her, and it made me realize how much I actually really do like this movie. This movie is retarded as all hell, but it has a very good story of friendship, determination, and yeah, I mean, it's a great family fun time. So yeah, good burger. Happy to have it, especially in this beautiful steelbook. I picked up Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. This is the Target exclusive digipack that comes with these really nice cards, actually. Here, I'm going to pull them out and show them to you. Yeah, there's these two cards. I mean, I would have preferred a booklet, but these are really nice. Very thick cards. I, I really do like this. And uh, that's the J card. So I saw this movie in theaters and haven't watched it since, but it's all right, I guess. It's mediocre, in my opinion. Although, it did have very nice horror elements to this movie. The horror elements to this movie were really, really, really nice. I did have a whole lot of fun with what was happening on screen, but when you think about it, this movie makes absolutely no sense. It's confusing, and when you compare it to the rest of the MCU, it's just a jumbling pile of crap, honestly. I mean, like, this movie confuses the multiverse with time travel. Um, it breaks the law with the Nexus copies. So, I mean, like, ugh, the MCU, I, I don't know. I think I'm officially done with the MCU. I don't know. I keep saying that I'm done with the MCU, but then I keep buying it. And I, I just, I'm so, I'm so over with the MCU, to be quite honest. And the last movie I picked up is Moonfall. This is the Target exclusive lenticular cover. I have not watched this yet, but this was on clearance for $6. So I went ahead and picked it up. Haven't seen it yet, but that is a very nice lenticular cover. I do know it's about the moon falling, falling to Earth, and it's going to kill us all. That's about as much as I know about the movie. But I'll get to it here eventually. But anyway, for $6, I couldn't say no to that lenticular cover. Now, I've already reached the digital code winners on Instagram quite a while ago. But I do have digital codes for next month. And I have Doctor Strange, Good Burger, and Moonfall. So if you'd like to be a winner of one or possible multiple codes, all you have to do is be a subscriber to the channel. Follow me on Instagram, find the thumbnail of this video, and ask to enter there. All right, everyone. I know that this is a very small haul, but I'm super sorry that this video is out late, but like I said, now that I have two jobs, I have less and less time to be doing videos. But like I said, I'm going to try to make videos every time I have spare time to do so, so that I don't fall behind on my YouTube channel. 
Anyhow, I hope you all have a wonderful night. Stay safe out there and take care. Have a great one.